Hey guys, what's up? It's Daniel with TrailerMountain.com and today I'm testing and reviewing the Powerfilm Lightsaver. This is a solar powered, ultra lightweight solar panel that rolls up into this nice little roll here and you can unroll it, strap it to the outside of your pack and it stores power all day while you're hiking so you can recharge your devices. So as I said, here it is right here. This thing weighs in at just under five ounces, 4.9 ounces. So you have these two little stretchy bungees right here. And this thing just unrolls. And there's your solar panel right there. It's really pliable, very flexible. You can easily strap this thing to the outside of your pack with the uh, using these bungees here. And there's also these little holes on the bottom here that you can actually lash through and strap to your pack. This way you can leave this thing to the outside of your pack and it'll store power all day long while you're hiking or just sitting still. And then it has its own built-in internal battery. So then you can plug in right here via USB and recharge your device. So I put it right here in front of my softbox lights and it does, you can see the green light starting to flash. So it is storing power right now, meaning that when a green light is flashing, that means it's charging. It has this nice little LED indicator right here. So it can tell you the state of charge. So, which is really nice. It also has overcharge, over discharge, and over current technology built into it. So it's definitely a smart charger. It will charge your devices properly. So another thing to keep in mind that when you have your solar panel here uh, absorbing power into its own little internal battery here, you don't wanna charge your device while it's collecting power. You wanna collect the power and then charge your device from the USB right here. And what I do is I'm gonna plug in my little USB right here. So I'm just gonna plug in my iPhone. This is a six plus. And she's charging. So super cool. Not only that, but look at the convenience of it. When you're done with it, you just roll it up. Wrap that around and you're done. So the USB out power is one amp at five volts. So it definitely has enough power uh, to recharge your devices. Now, granted, it's not gonna charge a tablet. Um, smartphone, GoPro cameras, absolutely, it'll do those. It's also weatherproof too. So, I mean, you can leave this thing, it can get a little wet, it's okay, but you definitely do not wanna submerge it. Um, it is a cylinder though, so they say if it does get wet, especially keep away from salt water too. So if it does get wet, definitely want to make sure you shake it out really good, get all the water out of it as best you can. Um, I wouldn't say take it apart or anything like that. There are screws, little Phillips head screws, two here and then two on the other side. So I wouldn't suggest taking it apart per se, unless you absolutely feel that you must. But keep in mind that if you do take it apart, you might void the warranty. It does have a two year warranty, by the way, which is still pretty good. So the internal battery in here will charge to full. It's six hours of direct sunlight. And I have tested this thing to completely dead, left it out in the sun for six hours and it was totally charged. So I did have to leave it out in the full sunlight though. It was not a cloudy day or anything like that. I left it out in the bare sun for six hours. And this thing got a little warm, uh, sit out in the six hour mark. So uh, keep that in mind. You know, if you're leaving this thing on top of your tent, it might get a little warm. Uh, it's not gonna melt it per se, but it definitely got warm. Keep in mind, these guys have been around for about 26 years making solar panels, solar um, modules, and solar technology. So these guys definitely know what they're talking about. They've been around in the business for a really long time. So as I said, it is super lightweight. It weighs in just at five ounces, or just under. It's like 4.9. You just throw it in your pack, you're done. Another thing that I really like is that it has a micro USB in right there. So you can actually plug this thing in USB, recharge it at home, and this way you have a full battery by the time you go out. Um, on most smaller smartphones like a 4S iPhone or iPhone 5, this thing will recharge it just over one full time on its own internal battery, which is still pretty cool. Six hours of sunlight will recharge this battery back to full, and then you have another full charge. Six plus is probably about 75% of a battery charge because I tried it on my six plus and I didn't get a full charge out of it. It does come with a USB to micro USB charging cable. And uh, as I said, it comes with everything you need. It's pretty much plug and play. Plug it in, charge it up, strap it to your pack, off you go. And then you have power in the backcountry 
lightweight. It's probably your biggest bang for your buck in lightweight compared to power output that I've seen so far. So as I said, you strap this to the outside of your backpack. So granted, if you're hiking away from the sun, that'd be fine. If not, what I would do is I would strap this to the outside, to the top of my pack, like this, just around the, the pack right here, right around the lid of the pack. This way it's always facing up, facing the sun, and sun's always beating down on it, charging your panel. Now, I know I said this isn't um, something you wanna charge a tablet with, like an iPad, but it does say on here that it is compatible with iPad. So is it gonna recharge an iPad back to full? Probably doesn't have enough power to do that, but it'll give it a little bit of juice. So if you do have an iPad with you, you should be all right. So I met these guys when I was an outdoor retailer and I was pretty impressed by the products that they're bringing out. You know, another cool thing is that their products are made in the USA. Super cool. I really like when companies actually build everything in-house in America and they don't outsource to other countries. So kudos to Powerfilm for keeping business local and hiring American. So great, great job there. All right, guys, so that's my review of the Powerfilm Solar Lightsaver. Here it is right here. This thing is just under five ounces. Solar panel you can strap to your pack, strap it to your, uh, to your bike pack or to your tent or anything like that. If you're in the back country and you need some power, solar panel is the way to go, especially something this light that puts out a good amount of power. So this is available on powerfilmsolar.com. Here's their website right here. Definitely want to make sure you check these guys out. These guys are making solar panels and modules and other smaller stuff like this, and they have been doing so for a really long time. Definitely worth a look at. So go check out their website, powerfilmsolar.com. If you like my review and found it informative, you want to get one of these for yourself, click on that link. I'll put a link down in the description box below so you can make your purchase. When you do, it helps support my website. Another way to help support is to click on that support button right on the homepage of my YouTube channel. When you do that, you can donate any number of dollars and that's gonna allow me to produce higher quality content to give back to you. Thanks again for tuning in to trailamountain.com. Please keep checking back for more gear reviews, outdoor related hodgepodge, and giveaways. Take care guys, get outdoors. <laughs>